We have a shield. It's got bees on it. Please use our shield, not just the random shield that you picked up. No, no, no. No, all the shields have to have bees, guys. Good morning, everyone. Dave from the Wee Hours here, back with some more of Manor Lords, where it's a beautiful spring day and we're probably all going to die soon. We have no food. We have no firewood. There's a enemy army on the march. They're on their way here at some point, and, um... I'm kind of surprised everyone's vaguely alive at this point. Let's look at some things, shall we? How about my granary? Okay, we do have somebody looking, or working rather, in the granary. That is being covered. How about the storehouse? Yep, we got someone working in the storehouse. Excellent. Things are going great so far. Windmill? Check. Somebody working there. How's the farm doing? That should be getting kind of back up and running at some point in time. I don't think we're growing anything right at this exact second. I'm ignoring crop rotation. Crop rotation is a myth. Nobody needs crop rotation. It's a very silly thing to do. Just keep your crops where they are. Don't rotate anything at all. But I think at some point, yeah, in 182 days, we are going to get some more wheat out of here. Uh, what's this? Generic storage is full. Okay. I understand those words. I'm just not sure why we're not moving things. I mean, we have the storehouse, and that's got plenty of room. Right now we've got, ooh, we've got quite a few planks. I didn't realize we'd made that many planks. We've got some stone, and we've got some hides. I did not know we needed, we had that many planks kicking around. Um, can I do anything fun with those planks? I don't have any iron ore yet, so I don't have any iron slabs, and I don't have any iron slabs, and I don't have any clay. Uh, barley, yeah, we're not into that right now. Oh, hides. I could make some leather. I don't know if I want to do that. Maybe we can sell it to somebody. How about if we put a tannery right here? Okay, that's probably really dumb. Virtually everything I've done in this game has been really dumb. But you know what? We've got the hides. We may as well be doing something with it. Now, something we should have no shortage of is housing. I've made a lot of houses. Okay, nobody has any excuse about housing around here. There are free houses all over the place. How's my mine doing? So iron deposit. No, that's as oh, it's an iron deposit. Okay. I didn't actually look at that. There's a lot of things I don't look at. That's why my comment section is full of things like, why didn't you look at that? That's an iron mine, not a stone mine. Is there a different thing for that? Mining pit. Okay. So we probably don't really need the stone mine at all. Yeah, I suppose, but keep it. I've, I've got it. I may as well have it. Well, let's put up this mining pit then. No iron deposit in range. There will be momentarily. Uh, how about right there? Okay, yeah, you guys are fine with that. Wow, that's a big, deep, deep, ugly pit, isn't it? Okay, somebody will get on that at some point. Dorothea, find some unemployed people. Tell them they've got a job to do. I'm going to get rid of this export the stone thing. Let's just let's just shoot that down. I don't I don't think we need to really be doing this. Um how about food? Can we get back to the concept of food? All right, I'm allegedly trying to import two loaves of bread. I don't think that's much to ask, but the import price is really more than I've got. That's probably not going to happen. Hey, somebody said I can upgrade my town. Current level small village. Open the development menu. Oh god, there's a tech tree. When did this happen? So I can go into a development of some sort. I can get trapping. That'll get me passive meat. Passive berries. Actually, doubles the capacity of berries. That's nice. Bees. That seems like a sensible thing to have. Sustain up to two apiaries by default. Oh, people love bees. People are all about bees. An orchardry. Okay, I could get some apples. Three years for those trees to grow, though. Three years. I don't got three years. Sheep grazing on the pasture slowly multiply. Now, I think... I don't think we get to eat sheep. Which is weird, because you could totally eat a sheep. The sheep don't like it, but you can totally eat a sheep. I think they just produce wool. Heavy plow, okay, for faster plowing on the fields. That's neat. Foreign supplies, you say. A firewood cart. A permanent market stall which provides passive income of firewood as long as the region has enough regional wealth. Oh, I don't have that. No, I don't have that at all. And then a food cart, kind of the same gig except bread. Trade logistics, establishing a new trade route, always costs a maximum of 25 wealth. Okay, that's fine armor making, and then charcoal burning. Oh, let's get bees. People just love to have bees. Now, is there anything in policies that I can do? 
Like, what does this do? Hunting grounds. Wild animals on rich de deposits breed faster. Oh, that's neat. Oh, but we lose crops because of it. Strict fasting. Citizens skip every fifth meal. I got news for you, Sparky. They're skipping every meal right now. There are no meals happening. Every fifth meal. That Don't even sweat the fifth meal, man. Just sweat this one. The one that we're doing right now. Um, can I have... This is locked in early access. Okay. Uh, well, you know what? Can I have this? I can't have this. I probably have to be a higher town level. Okay. Well, we've got bees now. What do I... Um, what do I do with that information? Yeah, there's raiders near in about a year. So I'm not going to worry about that today. That's tomorrow Dave's problem. I'm more concerned with bees. Okay, one apiary for a couple of planks. Well, that's got to be food, right? That's got to be food. Now, do you need to be a certain place, like near flowers? Because bees and flowers, they kind of go together like, well, bees and flowers, really. That's a pretty simple one. I'm going to put this over by these houses to make sure that these people's houses are infested with bees at all times. There's just nothing but bees going on there. In fact, you know what? Can we actually prioritize that? Can we make that a high-priority concept there? Let's get some bees on the property. I'm so sorry. Does somebody actually live here? Um, I'm so sorry. Nobody at all. Uh, good. Your house is full of bees. That's going to be a big surprise when somebody moves in. I never put anyone back in the forager hut, but there's berries now. So let's put a family back in there. Yeah, there's berries to be had. There's food to be made here. How's the uh, how's the old farm going on here, kids? Got that flax, and we've got, well, the concept of wheat. The concept of wheat exists. I don't, um, I think if I just done my houses correctly from day one, we probably wouldn't have to deal with this. Speaking of which, how are we doing? Regional wealth is five. That doesn't buy me anything in terms of these little housing upgrades. We got a couple of them. Somebody's got chickens. Yeah, you've got chickens, and you've got, like, a little garden plot there. Oh, the bees are up and running. Oh, where are my bees? Show me bees. Bring me to bees. Where did I put my bees? And the tannery just finished, too, which is great, if not quite as exciting as bees. I, I know I put my bees around here somewhere. That's a hitching post. That's a house. Okay, I'll find them in a bit. This this will all be fine. Um, talk to me about the tannery thing. Obviously, I need somebody to work there. Okay, do I really... Another ruler's army was sighted. Yeah, it's 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 where we're all going to die. We're not prepared for combat at all. I guess... Put someone in here? Maybe I can trade away some leather in exchange for literally anything else. Maybe I'll just hold off on that. I, I want to find the bees first, because I'm sure somebody has to work with bees. There's my apiary right there. Yeah, somebody definitely needs to work here. So let's get this going. All right. And I'm still fuzzy on why they're not transporting things. Because I have people working both in the granary and the storehouse. And they just don't seem to feel like doing that. Obviously, I'm doing something critically wrong. I know I'm always doing something critically wrong. Again, that's why the comment section is so full. It's great for engagement. Just so I can get an idea of what's going to happen. I'm just going to mess with my air quotes army right now. Uh, not enough funds for import. Ah, okay. Okay. So we tried to buy, buy some bread, but we didn't have the money. That does not surprise me. I was basically offering, like, can I please have this on tick? Like, just, just guys have some bread, man. Just please have some bread. Any bread. I don't care. All of my people are starving, and we've only got bees. So just so long as I have a vague understanding of what might happen with my air quotes army, I'm just going to, like, rally the troops. How do we do Rally the troops. Here we go. Everybody go over here now. Everybody go over here. Please? I think... Are we all going over here? Are we grabbing things like so? Oh yeah, yeah, you're in. Yeah, look at look at the team. Oh, the team's coming in here. The, they're they're oh my god, they're horribly mismatched. Oh, this is awful. All the uniforms are wrong. We have to get better uniforms around here. All your shields are different. We have a shield. It's got bees on it. Please use our shield, not just the random shield that you picked up. No, 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 no. All the shields have to have bees, guys. They all gotta have bees. Why don't you have bees on your shield? Okay, um, now here's the thing. How do I how do I get you to not do that anymore? I understand rallying you. Ah, here we go. Push forward. Uh, just slam it into pause mode there. Stand your ground. Okay. Uh, buy and sell you. Oh, balanced. Okay. And missile alert. <laughs> missile alert. Soldiers watch for enemy missiles. Chance to avoid. Give ground. Okay. And then what have we got here? Disband. That's the one I want. Run to positions and hold where you are. Okay. So I pick a rallying point, and um, 
Well, these guys show up. They're not much to look at. Admittedly, they're they're not they're not much. They all have horribly. Mi Which why does none of you have a shield with a bee on it? We have bees on our shield. We're all about bees. We're the bee folk. Okay, um, we're, we've saved the game. We're very excited. Okay, just disband, guys. Just just everybody go home. Every go well back to work. Actually, please back back to work. Back to back to work. Just everybody everybody go away. The bee guy's into work though. The bee guy's loving this. I don't know quite what he's doing. Making some weird motions there. I think he's miming cutting a honeycomb. He's actually nowhere near the honeycomb. But that's sort of the action I would expect if you were cutting a honeycomb off of a beehive. It looks vaguely cut like... Are you coming to get some bees? You're transport. Hang on, you're transporting. Uh, no, no, not you. The lady in front of you. Unassigned waiting. Are you getting bees? Are you getting... I think you got bees. You have imaginary bees, but I'm pretty sure you picked up some bees. And you're going to go... Yeah, you're transporting honey. Great! That might be food. No, it's definitely food. We had one honey and then it immediately went to zero. Imme that, that's fine. That's okay. I'll, I'll take the immediately going to zero. For a brief period of time, we had honey. Where are we at? It's still only March. Okay. What... What do I... What do I do so we don't all die? You know, I'm actually swimming in timber and planks right now. What if I put up the church? I bet people are busting for a little faith around here. Where does that actually live? Uh, not trade, right? No, it's definitely not trade industry. Oh, it's uh, probably in residential. Yeah. Uh, tavern. Oh, actually, I should probably put that up. Oh, that requires whatever that is. I'm, I'm going to guess that's clay. Probably looks like a clay icon. Uh, can I can I see that up here? Uh, no, everybody, everybody go away. Can I see that up here? That is... I, oh, no, not tools. What was that? Is that under, like, crafting material? Where, what what thing was that? I'm going to assume that was clay. All right, go back and look at the church again. So that's something that I don't have, long story short. Something that I don't have. And then the tavern, that's just five logs. And that just needs ale. I don't make ale, but I might be able to make ale. So talk to me about the industry side of things. So that was bloomery, smithy... Furnace, malt house. You need barley. We don't do barley right now, but we probably could. I don't see why I can't put up another farm. I don't see any reason that I'm not allowed to do that. Or another field, excuse me. Not another farm. Another field. So, barley. Yeah, wait, did I run into this the last time? Was this the one where barley doesn't actually, not actually work around here? But just for having a... Oh, wow, that's a really weird field, and I love every second of it. Um, could we put barley in here? Yes, yes, I can. Okay, somebody go make some barley over there. Quickly, please, we want to get drunk. Probably be a smart idea to add a second family to the farm. House. The farm house. The house of farming. Because that's a lot of fields that I'm asking them to do by hand with nothing but, well, you know their hands and a few raw tools. However, I kind of like some more people to move in before I commit that. Did we finish the mining pit? We did. Let's go ahead and get some folks in there. All right, that's where I'm going to sacrifice my last family there. And by sacrifice, I mean they'll undoubtedly be killed in a mining disaster because, well, that's the sort of thing that happens around here. How's the uh, how's the chickens doing, kids? You guys into this? Yeah, you're, you're totally into chickens. Totally into chickens. I have six regional wealth. That is not going to buy me anything at all. You guys are working on your little vegetable patch here. I say little. That's a sizable, sizable vegetable patch. You got a small farm here. Like, I don't have that. I grow vegetables. I don't have that many vegetables kicking around. That's You can get a lot going on there. Good job, you. But I'm sure I don't have anything to add. No, I don't have any of the regional wealth I need to do anything at all. Bakery extension. That would, might be nice blacksmith, brewery, joiners. Oh, we can make some shields. Can we make shields that have bees on them? We are still doing firewood, right? Yeah, okay. All right, we are we are definitely doing firewood over here. That that part's fine. Um, berries are looking good. I, I feel we, we should be doing... Okay, we have two berries. There's somebody here, right? Okay, there's... No, he's right there. He's right there. He's... Yeah, no, we're, we're, we're harvesting right now. Off to the berry patch, gathering some berries... Problem is, I've just got a bunch of people now. I got 45 people. It's a lot easier to feed them blueberries when there's only like 10 of them. And there's the stone over there. See, that stone cutting thing isn't doing me jack right now. 
Okay, let's get rid of this. Take the family out, and then just demo this nonsense. Uh, where do we go? De not re Actually, could relocate it where the stone is. Let's go relocate that where the stone is. So pop that guy over there. I also noticed there's a bunch of wild animals over there. Maybe move. Where is my hunting camp? These days I'm constantly losing track of that. That's the foraging hut. Uh, resource stolen. Yeah, the, the mystery ninja bandits popped in again. That's cool. Uh, if I click on that, will that take me? Yeah, it just takes me to the bandit camp. I, I know that. I get that bit. But that's pretty far away from where we are right now. I will be darned if I can actually find my hunter's camp. I'm pretty sure it's in there somewhere, but not real sold on that. I'm just going to build another one. I've got the resources. I may as well. So, remind me, is that gathering, uh, woodcutters, saw pits, foragers, hunting? There we go. Okay, so there's a big pack of them up here. Well, let's... Oh, hang on. I've already done it. I found it! Never mind, I found my hunting camp. I actually put it in a vaguely sensible location. Nobody's more surprised than me. And the mining seems to be going pretty well. My man's down here digging out some iron. I should probably do something with that, right? We should be making those iron slabs. How do we go about doing that nonsense? Smithy. Iron slabs. No, no, I need the iron slabs first. So the bloomery. Iron ore. Uh, new, new slow has been claimed. Uh, wait, is that me? Do I need to pay attention to this? I don't want to resolve the claim. That's that's a new slow pro problem. That's not a me problem. I'm putting up a bloomery. I'm all about bloomeries right now. Don't bother me with new slow's problems. I got bloomeries to be putting up. Let's put that guy. I'm I'm probably going to die for ignoring that, but here we are. Um, let's put this guy up over by the the iron pit. That seems like a smart place to put that. Okay, what is your problem now? Now I can look at you. Oh. I think I just declared war on Hildebolt. Hildebolt, Hildebolt, Hildebolt. Anyway, Hildy and I are um, are at war. I'm assuming when it says status winning, they mean him. Because it can't possibly be me. Both challengers must bring their armies to the battlefield. Uh-huh. When times runs out, there's no troops there. The lord who initiated the challenge wins. Okay, right, so there's a few words in there. So I'm supposed to bring my army to the battlefield. Army, right, okay. When time runs out and there's no challengees troops present on the battlefield, Lord who initiated the challenge wins. So can I just, like, time out on this? Can I just not show up to the battle? Would I, would I technically win? Propose to change the battlefield. Oh, yeah, we should have it right here. Come over to my place. Uh, use the king's favor that's locked and surrender. Why is surrender locked? I wanted to surrender. Show the battlefield, sure. Okay, is that anywhere where we are? Not as such, no. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna file that under, I will cross that bridge when I come to it. Alright, so if Hildy wants to come over here and start a fight, cool. I mean, we're all gonna die, but cool. And if Hildy goes to the battlefield and I'm not there... And he's like, ha ha, winner by forfeit, winner by default. I'm, I'm cool. That's fine. You can have whatever new slow is. I'm, I'm not really that interested in new slow. I'm interested in the fact that we're actually starting to gain food now. All right, so we're up to 30 berries and nothing else. Once again, we are eating nothing but berries. No meat, no vegetables. Well, I tell you what, it's, um, it's a bit of a berry bration around here. How about another honey thing, another apiary, because that seems to be working out great. And then eventually, I suppose, we'll get some wheat out of these fields, and we can do some bread? We have all the other elements of that. The windmill is working. The communal oven has somebody in it. It is technically working. I don't think there's anything to cook or bake, but there it is. You guys seem real excited about things. What are you doing? You're fetching water. Okay, you're transporting berries. Yeah, I know. You're going to need a big wheelbarrow for that one. We got a lot of berries around here, kid. And you're going home. Katarina's going home. And Beatrix is transporting even more berries. The ones that didn't fit in the wheelbarrow, Beatrix has just got put them in a bag and is coming down the road here. Well, we are definitely getting some iron ore. Iron ore is happening. Where did I, uh... We finished that bloomery nonsense that I was dealing with. Did we ever... Oh, I put it up here by the iron thing, didn't I? 
Um, did we ever deal with that? Are we, are we on board with the whole bloomery idea? No, it's under construction. And we haven't even transported the things over there yet. Wouldn't be a bad idea if I got another animal or two. I probably need that animal trading post for that. And how are we doing in the actual trading post? I mean, we're not doing anything because I can't afford to buy anything. But if, just for argument's sake, I wanted to buy some weapons... Oh, this is never going to fly. No way you guys are going to let me have some weapons. Look at that. 84? I got 10. 10. I got to find something to sell. This is the thing. So how about materials? What if I sold uh, some of the iron ore? Okay, some of the iron ore. So am I currently exporting here? Okay, no trade. Export iron ore. Uh, let's say five. Okay, just five iron ore. Okay, and what about something else? We're doing actually fine in the log game right now. Wool, herbs, iron slabs, firewood. No, I can't get rid of the firewood. Major trades, leather. Actually, we're doing leather. Do we have any leather? Do, we have any le Do I have that? Show me. I need a root for that one. Okay, so I can't just trade leather arbitrarily, willy-nilly. That makes sense. It doesn't, but that's fine. I, I can't do that. That's that's an okay thing. Um, here we go. Here's my... Wow, I've got a lot of planks. I've got a lot of planks. It's not a ton of money, but if I export it, like, way less than that, like, I don't know, 10. How about 10 planks? Okay, do you like that? I want to export 10 planks. I can't do it, but maybe soonish. I, wait, I can now. So I got 14. Do that. I got 14. 14 equals 14. I'm no mathematician, but 14 equals 14. Well, it's likely something that I'm once again doing critically wrong. Again, it's great for engagement. How about over here with 14? Can I do something? No. How about goats? 25? 25 regional wealth for goats? That's ridiculous. They're goats. They basically take care of themselves. One more and these cats could get a vegetable garden. Okay, and this plot level is too low for whatever I just said, a blacksmith's workshop. All right. Many of those words I understand. I think they're waiting on a church level. Yeah, I am too, kid. I am too. I would not mind putting a church up here. We're pretty sure, and by we I mean me, that I need the clay mining pit for this. So stone cutter and mining pit. Iron ore and clay. Okay, so will this cover both? Will you get clay and iron ore? Maybe if I put another family in there you might. You're close enough to both. I'm going to give that a shot. We haven't accumulated any clay at this point, right? Where does, where does clay live? Is that over here? Timber planks, blocks, no. Uh, hides, leather. Uh, there we go, down at the bottom, clay. Now, we haven't yet, but... I mean, that's right next to the clay deposit. How about if I get... Would, would it help if I just put a little road up here? For no reason. Just to make your life a little bit easier. Like right to there. Okay, right to there. I'm just gonna try and make life easy. Oh no, I'm losing Nuslo. Oh dear lord. I'm so sad. Oh, I just got three regional wealth for reasons that I can't adequately explain. Oh, that's gotta buy me something on one of these plots. That's got to buy me something. Uh, show me. Show me a thing that I could be doing here. Yeah, there we go. Get vegetables in there. I know that just blew all of my regional wealth. But get vegetables in there. Anything so you guys can eat. I say that. We're actually up to 79. 77 of which is berries. We are swimming in berries right now. We have so many berries right now. Firewood's looking uh, broadly competent, although I'm making a lot more things that require firewood in terms of production. This might be another spot. It might be an idea to put another family in here. But why don't we... Remind me again, what are we What are we looking at for that church nonsense? Are we sure that's clay? And by we, I mean me. I'm pretty sure that is probably rock. Uh, is this my stone cutting thing? Does anyone work there? No. Put somebody in there. Because if that's rocks, I can get that going pretty quickly. Uh, I think it is. The clay and the rock icon look very, very similar. Um, what was that problem? I don't know anymore. Not enough food. Well, I think we're good on food. Probably fuel is the issue. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe... I could actually just put up... Well, there'd be no point to putting up a second woodcutter's lodge when I can put more people in this one. How's the new slow thing going? Oh, yeah, we're losing. We're only about... Three months away, 90 days, yeah, three months away from barley. I should probably 
I say this out loud. I want to make sure I didn't already build it. I should probably get whatever it is, the, the malt making place where we make beer into things. What was that? Uh, bloomery, smithy, clay, malt. There we go. The house of malt. That's just four, who's the what's it's there? Four logs. There's no reason not to just get it established. Um, where does booze live? I'd like the tavern to live kind of in the center of town, probably over by the windmill. That looks like a great spot. So maybe I can tuck this guy over here and that will be reasonably close to the barley when that comes out. Okay, are we producing clay at this point? And if not, what does it take for me to make you guys go get clay and iron ore? Check this, check that, I want to check my mining pit again. Yeah, clay from clay deposits. Clay, for, it's very clearly laid out there. Clay from clay deposits. Wow, I have 100 food, 98 of which are berries. 98 of which are in fact berries. How's the stone coming, kids? Are you having fun with the stone cutting? Now that's the hunting camp. I don't know how much fun we're having over there. So stone cutting, okay. Yeah, we've, we've got, we've got stones, we got rocks here. Can I build a church? Yes, yes I can. Okay, uh, one church please. Yes, I know we're saving the game, we're very excited about that. Uh, this is, should probably also live in the center of town, but that's not really realistic. Uh, let me start with a road. We're just gonna kinda wrap around the fields here. Yeah, you can, you can go to there if you want. And there, and then over to here, and then can I squeeze that into there? Just like that, perfect, exactly where I wanted it, kind of. And then let's go back to uh, churchy folks here. And yeah, maybe on the edge of town, maybe here. That part, that's okay, I don't completely hate that. If I kind of want to, kind of want it down here. You know what, this is gonna have to do for folks. All right, if they need a little religion, they're going to have to have a short walk to go and get it. Oh, we made bread from somewhere. Did we get wheat? I don't think the wheat's done yet, is it? That's like another 74 days to wheat. I don't know. Maybe somebody must have turned up with some bread. Some random person like, hey, I got a loaf. I got a loaf of bread right here. Oh, we're getting some veggies there. I'd like to get chickens. I'm told chickens are like a no-brainer. You just get tons and tons of eggs. But again, I've only got the five regional wealth at this point. I am rocking a 58% approval rating, though, and no crime. Yeah, I am going to slap another family in the Woodcutter's Lodge. We're just not making firewood quickly enough. Let's see if we can kind of double up on our production there and get that going a little bit faster. We're surprisingly fine on food, if you don't mind eating berries. The firewood situation is not good, though. We're not okay with that. How are we doing with, uh, well, anything else? We've got the iron ore. Did my, um, my bloomery ever take shape somewhere over here? Because that's another family I need to allocate here. Um, talk to me about bloomeries. How are we doing? Okay, so requires refueling. Yes, no doubt it does. No doubt it does. Um, so I've only got the one unassigned family right now. I wouldn't mind waiting until somebody else moved in and then assign somebody to the bloomery. There we go. Somebody poked their head in the door in July and said, yeah, I'll basically go ahead and live here. Good. Let's throw someone in the old bloomery then and get some iron bars or slabs or whatever it is. So somebody else is moving in. Good. Excellent. Um, how are we getting clay? How's that working out? I see 175. I get that. I understand that. That's a number. It's a number between 150 and 200. Just not understanding if we're actually getting clay or if I need to build another mining pit near the clay. Uh, what am I building down here? Oh, yeah, the malt house. Wow, that's taking a while, isn't it, guys? Oh, uh, you guys want to get drunk or what? Apparently, I'm winning New Slow now. Nope, now I'm losing New Slow. It's up, it's down, it's back and forth, it's all over the place. It's a crazy hodgepodge mis mishmash of something. I assume somebody will pop up and let me know when I've actually lost that. The church is going up, though. Yeah, all the things are in here. We've got a couple of logs that we need to put in here. But broadly, the church is under control right now. Uh, what's the problem here? Work area is empty. Who? What are you? The forager hut. Really? Wow. Got all those berries, huh? Hmm. Okay. Do I have any other berries that are somewhat close by? Not really. Not really. Okay, well, that's all our berries for the year, but, on um, you know, good news us, that's 148 berries. That's 148 berries that I've got right now. How are we doing here? I've got 11 months of food. Only two months of fuel. 
but 11 months of food. Well, in that case, there's no real reason to have anyone in the forager hut if there's nothing to forage. You guys can just, well, find something else to do. Uh, could I interest you in either beer production or the clergy? Yeah, I was probably supposed to do crop rotation or something because my wheat sucks. My, my wheat just didn't pop this year. Yeah, okay. Well, you know what? We've got a lot of barley coming in. How soon is that coming in, by the way? 50 days. Okay, 50 days for barley. And then some flax. I should think about... I just took some people out of the forager's hut. I should think about putting up whatever the thing is that makes flax into something. Uh, what, what would that fall under? Uh, show me. Dyeing. Okay, weaving. Weaving. That sounds like a thing. Wool to produce yarn. Flax to produce linen. Yeah. Yeah, we should have, like, that, basically. I'm gonna wait on that until the church is going. Uh, the malt house is ready. Do I want to throw somebody right in there right now? I don't really, don't really know, because the barley's not going to be going anywhere for a while. We've got a little bit of time waiting on that. How's the Nooslow situation? Okay, eight days left, and we're losing this time. Dorothea, keep me appraised of new slow diplomacy and things like of that nature. I'm very, I'm very, in I know I'm being sarcastic, Dorothea. I'm being sarcastic. I'm not actually that interested in new slow. I'm sure it will resolve itself. Now, what I've also got is a teeny tiny bit of regional wealth here. So could we maybe, uh, just hang on, I should probably check if somebody actually lives here. Somebody actually live here? Uh, no, nobody actually lives here. Wait, does anyone live here? Did I put up a farm where no people live? I put up a farm where no people live. Oh, go me. Go me. That is, um, that's awesome. Uh, you've already got chickens. Okay. I need a plot where people are both living and interested in something else. Okay, Jacob is in here. Great. Uh, what could we do with your thing here? Nothing at all. Fifteen. Wait. Where'd all my regional wealth go? Did I trade it away? Am I still trading? I thought I was exporting. That usually means money to me. Okay, shut down this. Uh, we've declared peace. with Hil Hildy and I have declared peace. I don't even know how that happened. I think we're like half a planet away. But I'm just like, yo, Hildy, let's just chill on this. And Hildy's like, yeah, cool, man. Forget it. Yeah, I'm just gonna temporarily shut down all trade. I, I, don't, I don't want any more trade. Okay, I did just stop with the trade. I, it's a little fuzzy. And I think I should just stay close to home and focus on what we're doing right now. Because the firewood situation is back up and running. We're up to 24 firewood. Food, so long as you don't mind eating nothing but berries, is actually very good. And if I hadn't just spent all that regional wealth, I could have got something going on in one of these plots here. Is this one big enough to do anything with? It's not. Okay, that's fine. You don't get anything. You can go next door. There are bees right there. Okay, the storage is full on the stonecutter camp, so I'm coming back to trade. Let's just try the whole exporting stone nonsense, because that, that seemed to be going okay. All right, let's just try and export, say, 15 stone. You need rocks. We got you covered. Somebody just moved in. That's awesome. How's my church? Because my church is almost done the last time I looked at it. How are we doing here? We've got a wooden church. Okay. Would somebody like to join the clergy? Church bell sound. Is that just sort of, just sort of an alarm thing? Oh, it's changing the church bell sound. I don't know. I got it muted in my headphones. I have no idea. So assign a family to that. Congratulations. You're a priest now. Now, with that being done, can I now upgrade a house or two? So level one. Okay. What do you need now? Now you need beer. Okay, you've got water, you've got a church, but you need beer. Okay, we can, we're working on that. We are broadly working on the vague concept of getting you drunk. Generic storage is full. Is it really? Are you sure? Because I'm seeing 174 out of 250 on generic storehouse here. Granary, how about that? Nope, that's 139 out of 500. My God, we've got a lot of berries in there tiny bit of honey and some berries. Sounds like a really nice dessert, but I don't know if that's going to sustain you day to day. Maybe I should just build another storage? Oh, hang on. Slam it into pause mode. I've got 36 regional wealth. Oh, somebody's getting some upgrades around here. Okay, show me somebody who actually lives in a house. Uh, somebody is living here, right? Correct? Yes, maybe. Okay, somebody actually lives here. What could we do? We could actually get away with goats. That would, boy, that would gut my regional wealth. I'd like to get like two things if we could. So chickens are 25. So are the goats. And those are 15. 
Okay, can't quite do both. What's goats going to do for me? Hides. I don't really care about hides. I'm a little more concerned about keeping the food up and running. Let's do chickens in this one. Okay, we're going to do chickens over there. You guys are getting some chickens. Yeah, I think these guys are just doing iron. So I'm going to take somebody out of there. And then I'm going to put up another one of these over here, near the clay. So remind me, that's mining. mining. Oh, you got a regular mining pit. Yeah, I think it's got to be sort of more up here. I don't care about trees getting uprooted. Why would I? What do you mean no deposit? There we go. Put it down right there. Don't sass me, game. And once again, generic storehouse full. Do these have some sort of radius on them? Is there, so like, we only are going to carry it if it's close enough kind of thing? What else have I got? I can destroy it. I don't want to do that. I don't want to pin anything to anything. I'm going to just throw up another one. Maybe over on this side of things. Maybe it's just, uh, they're not going to walk that far. Also, we could probably really use a road between A and B here. Because that's, um, that's a long walk to go around there. So if I wanted to, say, do generic storage. Do I have anything new, by the way? Granary, storehouse, pack station. All right, send and receive goods through this and another region in my command. Okay, I don't have any other regions in my command. I've already lost New Slow. Yeah, we're just going to do a generic storage sort of right over here. I wonder if I should be doing another marketplace over here. This is a, kind of a long walk for them to go over and get food, I feel. And what are we doing on that? Yeah, 132 berries. Eggs are coming in, so where's the honey? Okay, why is... The hunting lodge really hasn't paid out, has it? Also, by the way, is there anyone working there? There's nobody working there. That's why we're not hunting anything, Dave. Literally nobody works there. There are no hunters. We're not hunting anything. You're sitting there wondering why you don't have any meat. It's because nobody is going and killing the tiny woodland animals, or big woodland, woodland animals, I don't care. But nobody's going and killing them, and bringing them home, and skinning them, and cooking them, and eating them. Now, in the win column, contrary to the opening of this episode, where we had zero food and zero firewood, now I've got 139 food and 49 firewood. It's the first time this barrel hasn't been an angry red. Right, I've got 10 months of, fo of food and 3 months of fuel. That's about as good as I've ever done. You're, again, you're saying generic storage is full. We're going to hopefully cope with that by putting up a completely different one somewhere else. But that's probably an excellent place to call it on Manor Lords. Guys, do keep, please, please keep the comments coming in. Let me know what you're thinking of this. And hey, if you enjoyed the video, do please leave a like down below. It does cheer me up. No end when people do that. And if you're new to the channel, maybe just checking it out for the first time, feel free to hit that subscribe button. See more of this ridiculous nonsense. Until then, I'm Dave. Thank you, as always, for joining me in the wee hours, and we'll see you next time. But maybe we close the door during a zombie apocalypse, Cinnamon, huh? It's just basic security technique. If the door is closed, Cinnamon, Cinnamon, the zombies are going to have to work harder to get in. What you've done is put up a big sign on the top of your roof here that says, Hey, zombies, this way for food. All right, is there an actual fire or are you just telling me that fire is a thing that exists? Because I'm very familiar with that. Fire loves me and it wants to be near me at all times. And I'm pretty sure they're trying to beat him to death with a baguette, which is less effective than you might commonly think it would be. I have created epic fruitcake. Those words have never been uttered in the entirety of human history. That sentence has never come together. I have made epic fruitcake.